Hi, I'm Charlie Kasov. I'm a math teacher, and today we're going to discuss the disadvantages of Roman numerals in mathematics. Now, the most important disadvantage to the Roman numeral system is that there's no fractions and there's no zero in Roman numerals. So if you had v or 5 minus 5 equals, well, nothing. You can't figure it out because there's no zero in Roman numerals. Or if you have a pi and you want to divide it up, well, you could say i over 2i, which would be 1 half, except no Roman person would know what you were talking about. Now, another disadvantage is the weird order and the weird rules of Roman numerals. For example, vi is 6 and iv is 4. The rule is this is a 5 and this is a 1. If the, one, the smaller number comes after the big number, you add it. But if the smaller number comes before the big number, you subtract from the big number. And this is different from uh, the modern system where we would, this is 5, 1, so we'd say 51. And this is 1, 5, so we'd say 15. Here you're adding and here you're subtracting. So I'm Charlie Kasov, and you just learned the disadvantages of the Roman numeral system. Thanks a lot.